Well, I had, um, I felt like I had already thought through matters of faith and had rejected uh, the Bible's authority. I, I felt strongly that the Bible itself was just oral history and quite frankly, I wouldn't trust a chocolate chip cookie recipe, uh, you know, rooted in oral history. I, I also found it to be um, um, heavily moralistic, um, um, confusingly arbitrary about laws and rules and customs, um, appalling in its gender politics, offensive in its statements about slavery, and um, at best I thought the Bible was a cultural artifact. Um, in addition to that, I found Christians to be sour and anti-intellectual and um, unpleasant and unfriendly and quite frankly Christians just seemed like people who were very happy to live on a sort of starvation diet of ideas and community. To uh, top it all off I was um, living in um, serially monogamous lesbian relationships. I had co-authored um, the first domestic partnership policy at Syracuse University and I quite frankly could not understand why Christians would not leave consenting adults alone. And so my, um, my post-tenure book was going to be a, uh, an examination of, uh, of Christianity from a lesbian feminist perspective because I, I, uh, I wanted to explore some of these I ideas of the way that a text, the Bible, interfaces with culture. So all of that I thought would probably make me a pretty unlikely convert.